everybody. I just rolled out of bed. And it's raining in Western Massachusetts. Clearly, we have an umbrella. The last thing I want to do is get in my car and drive myself to New York City. So we have got a King Ward bus to take us all the way to... The Big Apple, my afternoon snack. She means New York. We're going to New York. We're going to New York, and we want you to come along with us. Let's go. We got on the bus, took our seats, and met our trusty bus driver, Alan Diaz, and our friendly and knowledgeable group leader, Belgi Bo. She introduced herself to the group and let everyone know the important details of the day's trip. Belgi gave everyone a packet with the day's itinerary and a New York City map, so hopefully no one gets lost in the Big Apple. We give them a lot of information, information on upcoming trips and for the trip that they're doing, for instance, today on their own, we'll tell them some information of the area where we might be passing by depending on traffic. Um, always important where we're going to drop them off and where we'll be picking them up. And New York City can be a little overwhelming, but you know, it's a, it's a city, it's a grid, so it's pretty simple. And they try to put the drivers and escorts that kind of are more familiar with the destination. All of the seats are filled, everyone is comfortable and looking forward to a fun day. Belgi explains many of the reasons that a bus is a great choice. Fuel, fuel costs, you don't have to drive. We do the driving, we do the parking. We're the ones that have to do all the behind the scenes stuff. So you get to relax. When you get there, you see your show and then we're the ones that deal with the traffic and everything else along with it. We have Wi-Fi now and we have electrical outlets. There's a bathroom on the bus so you don't have to pull over anywhere and use it. You can just go right to the back. We have the monitors so we'll put a movie on occasionally depending again where we're going and how much time is permitted. We are having a great time on the bus. I'm so comfortable. The seats are comfy. We just got to the rest stop. And the best part about this bus ride for me so far is that we have free Wi-Fi. I've been able to check my scores the whole time, everything, really. And I forgot to charge my iPod, but guess what? There's outlets so you can charge your phone or your iPod right on the bus. I'm about to read my magazine and take a nap because I don't have to drive. We're going to watch a movie, but first I have to use the restroom. Restroom on the bus. There's curtains in the bathroom, too. I'll be back. We left the rest area and got back on track to New York City. We passed the time reading magazines, taking naps, using free Wi-Fi, catching up on phone calls, rocking out to some music. And we planned out our big day in the Big Apple. We asked Belgie where she recommends we visit. Definitely the Times Square area, Rockefeller area, Rockefeller Center area, um, the Empire State Building, because where we drop you off, we try to have you in a neutral, you know, central place. And a lot of those major destinations and tourist spots, it's right there. So it's not an expensive cab ride down to, to get there. The subway is there, that it's very simple. There's no one, if you've never been on the subway, it's very simple. And I can answer also a few questions regarding that as well. We can't wait for the fun day ahead. New York City, here we come. Woo! And here we are, right in the heart of Manhattan, Times Square. Let's go have some fun. It was a great bus trip. Great bus trip. Easy. I took a nap. I'm refreshed. Listen I'm to music. I charged my iPod. I didn't even have to worry about parking. Let's explore. A day in the Big Apple. I had so much fun today. I had such a great time. I'm so tired. Me too. And the best part is, doesn't matter if you had a little too much to drink, if you're a little too sleepy. Or if you're a little too full. Yeah, because we're not driving home. No driving. I can't wait to sleep. Let's do it. Let's go. All the passengers come back to the bus tired, but so excited from their day in New York. Oh, it was awesome, awesome. Um, I got tickets for Wicked for my niece for her birthday. Our day was awesome. Um, we came out, we took a long walk down to Greenwich Village. We had a lot of coffee. Um, we went to Madame Tussauds, which was awesome. They have a 4D Avengers show going on, which is really great. Um, so it was just an exciting day. We did a lot of stuff, and we got some very cheap and delicious pizza, so that was great. And it's even better because you don't have to drive home after a very long day. 
And we enjoy coming down on King Ward because we don't have to park, we don't have to pay for gas, and just not have the stress of driving around. So it's a lot of fun. My dad and I come a lot on the trips, and we look forward to them. But we didn't hit any traffic. It's awesome. A very smooth ride. Perfect. Perfect. We're going to definitely do another King Ward to New York again. Yeah. Uh, you don't have to drive in. Yeah. You know, you yeah. don't have to worry about um, driving home. Mm -hmm. So it was actually pretty nice. So from the staff to the service, it's no wonder why people choose to take King Ward buses to get to a travel destination. Um, they're always very nice. We always, we, this is our third one. We always feel very informed. We know where we're going to get picked up. We know what to expect. So absolutely great. And we get here safe. So that's all you can ask for. Staff, wonderful. <laughs> Well, we had a great day in New York City. We're on the bus back to Springfield, and all I have to say is I am so glad that I'm not the one driving. I can kick back, relax, take a nap, like this guy here. He's already sleeping, and it was, it was just such a great time. I got these great glasses. No, you're jealous with a pink mustache. Seth, I, I want you to let Seth wake up, wake what? up. What? Let everyone know how much fun you had in the city. Are recording right now? Yes. Yeah. I had a really good time in the city. It's so much of a good time that I'm sleeping. I walked the whole thing, had so much fun. Nice glasses. Thank you. Nice. And we had a great time in the Big Apple. You're still with the Big Apple jokes? She's had that apple all day long. You're supposed to eat the apple, not just make Big Apple jokes. It's just eat, eat your apple. Eat your apple. Your skin apple. and bones. You go back to sleep. I'm going back to sleep. Good night, everyone. <laughs> He's going to sleep, I'm also going to sleep, and then I'll eat my apple. We'll see you in Springfield. King Ward Coach Line prides themselves on their competitive prices and quality service. Dennis King is the president of King Ward Coach Lines, and he's here to tell you more. Dennis, thank you so much for a great trip. Great. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Oh, oh it he had such a blast. And Seth took, took my glasses. What I've, do you think of those? I've stolen them. Uh, I he's think stolen. they're special. <laughs> they're very special. They're special is very the special. correct word. Only I think that's exactly York. what they are. Now, very nice, Seth. I'm going to take them off now. The, <laughs> these buses, we talked about how wonderful they were to take to, to any destination that you're going to because they were furnished with so much. Yes, we, uh, we bought six of them brand new. They all have seat belts and Wi-Fi, um, power outlets throughout the bus. So it's really nice if, like you, if you forget to charge your, uh, your, walk, your uh, cell phone <laughs> or your laptop yeah. Yeah. or something, you can just plug it right in and away you go. So nice when you're traveling, absolutely. And your staff is really wonderful as that, well. That's good to hear. We have some long-term employees that work for us. And uh, Al Alan, uh, your driver, he's worked for us for quite some time. He actually left and came back. So oh, yeah. when, when people do that, it tells me they like, you know, the place is a good place to well, work. And absolutely. It, you could tell definitely that he cared a lot about each person's individual, like if they had a good time or not. He was invested in it, which is nice to see. It, it, it's one of the things we do is we try to assign drivers to their bus. So they drive that bus all the time, so it's almost like they do have ownership in it. Mm -hmm. Belgie's another long-term employee. She's done a lot of different things for my company, so, and uh, she, she's a valued person to have working for us. Now, we went to New York City, but there are many other different options for travel destinations through yep, New York. We, we have some, uh, actually in October, we're doing some trips to Salem. Um, we have a pumpkin festival in Rhode Island, Providence, Rhode Island, that we're doing. And, uh, and of course, more New York City trips come to, in December for shopping and uh, Radio City Music Hall. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that's a beautiful time of year to go to New York, too, especially when you don't have to do any of the driving. Yeah, that's, it's nice, especially in the winter. You know, there's the driving, there's all the Christmas lights are up. Um, it's snowing out. It's really nice. C sit back and relax. Let us do the driving for and you. And especially that trip to New York, we didn't even talk about the affordability, which is really incredible. Yeah, we, we try to make the trips affordable. Mm -hmm. um, we, you know, we base it on so many people. So uh, it, it's one of the things that we like to do. Well, yeah. and, and if you think about it, say, if I personally wanted to go drive to New York, it's gas, it's mileage on your car, it's paying presumably the parking ticket that you're going to get when you're in the city yeah, exactly. because it's impossible to exactly. park in New York City. I don't, I don't know how they park the buses in New York City. I don't, know I don't ask we'll questions. Leave it to yeah, them. exactly. Now, in addition part. to all the other trips that are coming up, there's a lot more information on the website that people can, can yeah, find it's, out uh, about King Ward. It's kingward.com. We have a, a list of our upcoming trips, and of course, we do Mohegan Sun on a daily basis, and that's always a big destination for us, also. And now we have to ask about your dogs because they're adorable. <laughs> they're in the commercial with you. You couldn't bring them today. No, no, they uh, they're actually at doggy daycare oh. today. So good for yeah. you though. It's, it's good to put them in that. Yeah, you know, we daycare. have uh, we have two miniature Schnauzers, Andy and Derby, and uh, they come to work with me most of the time. And then sometimes they're at do doggy daycare. 
Oh, that's Burn so off some fun. of that energy. So. Right. That's great. Well, Dennis, thank you so much again for our trip to New York. We had such a wonderful time. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Glad and we know everyone it. else did as well. Oh, definitely. It's always good to hear. <laughs> yeah, it's great to have you here. Yeah. And you can learn more about King Ward Coach Lines by visiting them online at kingward.com. You can also give them a call at 413-593-3939.